Well, it's a beautiful spring day, and I've got the crud. Thanks to my beautiful wife. She gave it to me. It's funny, you try to stay away from somebody who's got the crud and it just doesn't work out, does it? But, uh, the painting's done. I'm not too excited about the colors, but it's fine. I wish there was more of a pop to the colors. But the view will make up for the rest. Okay, quick story. This is our sewer connection in the street. It's a street cut. Okay. Goes all the way up the hill. There's the back of our house up there. You haven't seen that view before, have you? Anyway, the sewer was down here on this street. Okay. And the, the plumbing contractor told me that they were probably going to have to patch the whole street. In other words, the code in our area says if you come more than halfway across the street that you have to actually mill the asphalt back 10 feet on either side and do a, cut, a street cut all the way across. Not a street cut, but you have to mill the asphalt back and replace the asphalt. So that's going to be like another 1500 to two thousand dollars. Well, this is the patch job that the plumbing contractor did, and I said that should be good enough because this road is like hardly even used. It's almost like an alley. And he said, "Well, no, I got to. I'll have to fix it." And I said, "I tell you what, I'll pay you for what you've done so far, and then when you fix this part, I'll pay you." But I honestly told him I didn't think they were going to have to do it or that they were actually going to do it. <laughs> so he uh, he reluctantly agreed and sure enough I found out the other day that we are not going to have to fix this street any more than what is his here now. I've got the crud and I can't talk. But originally they thought they were going to have to go all the way back up to there, over, down, back. So, I'm telling you this story to make sure that if a plumbing contractor comes to you and tells you that if you're making a street cut, that you will have to fix the street. It may be true, but don't pay them until they've done it. It's funny, people drive by and I'm talking to the camera and they're like, what is that guy doing? But anyway, uh, that's just a little lesson. Actually, my instincts always are pretty much right when it comes to paying people. Uh, it's because I'm an expert in human behavior. And the reason I say that is because if I had gone ahead and paid him for the whole job, he would have never come out to fix this because the city wasn't going to require him to. And he probably would have kept my money at the same time. So, or it would have taken me six months to get it back. So anyway, just trying to pass that along.
try to help out the brothers in the YouTube community. Of course, none of that might have made sense with my cold, but if it did, and it saves you in the future, I've accomplished my goal. <laughs> Thanks, guys.